Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Leo the Leoparder. Hey, we are playing Sims. The Sims game. I'm pretty excited about it. I just literally opened it up. I've been waiting for this game to come to uh, the PS4 for months and months and months and decades or whatever. Um, so we're going to do this shot. I started my character out a little bit because I couldn't figure out how to turn the music off. because It's a whole new uh, game, of course. So, But I figured it out finally. And so what I did was basically is I just created my name. Um, and then I found out I can come here for <laughs> my customization. I can go all different types of clothing and outfits. And let's see. Let's see here. Um, can the Sims use a toilet standing? Yes. Can the Sims be able to engage? Yes. Clothing preference? Uh, let's go with the male, of course. Yeah. And how do we save? And then you can do like toddler, child, teen, young adult, adult. Uh, let's do adult so we can go to work Your maybe. Um, you know, let's go young adult, I guess. Let, let, let's see here. Uh, and then our walking. So this is our walking. We got money. And we got jazz. We got some butterflies. We're good. We are muscular. <laughs> We're a little tired, aren't we? We're really tired. We are happy. And then we're zombie style. Look at that. I think I should go this one. Uh, add sim to an edited relationships. I don't have that access. But down here, I picked, uh, well, it was already picked for me, but uh, I picked uh, popularity because I want to have a lot of friends. Um and then a party animal or a joke star or a friend of the world. The Sims wants to make and keep as many friends as they can. Or the Sims wants to tell jokes and become famous comedian. Mm. Or a party animal where the Sim wants to throw and attend amazing parties. I think we should want to be friends of the world. Um, and then uh, pick a trait. Uh, I don't know what I want to pick. Um, let's see here. Goofball. Could be, I think goofball would be kind of cool. Uh, the Sims tends to be happier than other Sims. Uh, hothead, no. Ooh, uh. let's see here. There's a lot of traits. Um, ooh, uh, loves outdoors. That would be a good one, wouldn't it? Uh, the Sims, uh, it's like natural outdoor Sims becomes happier when outdoors. But I'd like to be indoors too, like get like the build and stuff. Um, let's see here. What's this one here? I guess I can pick all these uh -huh. or one of these or two of these. I don't know. Uh, he's good. The Sims is happy around Sims with positive modlets. And let's see. Charity, sad, when evil Sims detects the world's peace. Hates children. Evil. Bro. Ooh. Um, family. Let's see here. Jealousy, mean, outgoing. Let's go family, I guess. Oompatosh, you sheep. Okay. And then let's go with, um, this is kind of hard. I got uh, outdoor living, outdoor, because we're going to build a pool and stuff, you know? And then let's go with, ooh, he's a foodie maybe. Hmm. L music lover. I love music. Okay. And then. Okay. 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 We're going to go with a family outdoors and cheerful. Okay. So. All right. So, oops. I gave my, my, my person a name. Why isn't Leo working? I, I don't understand. Give your Sims a first and last name. I did that. But it's not liking it for some reason. <laughs> what if we just go with a random like... Ooh. Just random like that. I want to see what happens. Ooh. No. We're going to just say it with Leo because obviously that's my name. And it should like it. But what if we get rid of the space? Did he get rid of the space? Yes, it did. Okay. And then that's all for that trait. And then let's see. What else is there? We could save household. Hey, hey we're going to save. Oh, but first, 
Uh, real quickly, check this out. I found this. Uh -huh. I don't know what that just did. Um, mm. We want to go... No, 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 no. Yeah, I know about that. Here we go. We can try... We can switch. <laughs> I switched to a female. Okay, go back to male. Okay. And then... I was looking for... Where was it? I, I was looking for... Um, uh, let's see. I was looking for the change of clothing and stuff. But this mm. works. Select the check mark to save your this household library and begin to play. All right, let's do it. Here we go. Uh oh, moving in. Your Sims needs a place to live in the world. We'll show you several perfect homes in Willow Creek and Oasis Springs. And the home you choose offers a unique neighbors and attractive activities. Sorry about that, but don't worry. You can always visit. Or move to any of the new of the worlds in The Sims 4. Would you like to learn more about moving in? Sure. Willow Creek. Ooh, I like that. Uh, the desert's not really for me. It's more of a dinosaur. Oh, in the city life, that would be kind of fun, wouldn't it? Can I have 40 of this stuff? I'm going to say let's go here. That whole, like, city life. So we, we got 20. Looks like we have 20. 20,000, I guess. Sims money, so we need to buy a house. Um, this one's a good spot right here. I like this one. Um, it's pretty big. It's probably one of the biggest ones on the lot. It has a beautiful view of the ocean or the lake or whatever that is. So I think we're gonna confirm that one. Okay, we purchased house. Live mode is where the Sims eat, sleep, chat, and live out their lives. Under your control, of course. Do you want to see? Yeah, we'll see the live more trail. Okay, there's many new features in The Sims 4. Before we can take, before we can get to all of them, we need to cover the basics. First, we'll quickly learn how to control your Sims. Okay. So we're gonna learn how to. Ooh, this is me. Hello, I'm Leo. Okay. All right. So we have no friends. Looks like we're calling somebody to go boxing. Loves the outdoors. Leo loves the outdoors. Getting outdoors often is required for the Sims, but the emotional rewards is well worth it. I'm happy. Can I zoom out? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. So that is my... I think that's my, my, my land, and I'm going to try to find, find out if I can buy that other one next door, too. <laughs> uh, but I live here. All right. Uh-oh. What happened? Ah. I don't know what I just did. I don't know what I just did. Um, so, hi! Acquire the video game gaming skills. Leo can further develop his skills on computers, tablets, motion game rings, or even his phone. And here comes somebody else. It's a train. Okay. Oh, there's my mouse. I've been looking for my mouse. I need to build. I think that's what that means right here. Build mode. Okay, here we go. Uh... Welcome to build mode, which is the Sims 4 is easier to build or to use and more powerful than ever. With a little bit of help, you'll be designing incredible homes and building in no time. Buildings in no time. Would you like to see? Sure. We'll see. General controls. Before we can start building a wonderful creation, you'll need to know how to get around. We'll show you how to do that. Okay. Press L3 to view the controls. Right, down, left, up. Obviously, view control, confirm, and pause menu. Okay. Okay, next tip. When you select tool activity, move your cursor over to the object and press X. I did that already. We know all that. If you're holding an object, you can sell it with a triangle. And if you're holding an object, you can place it in the inventory with square. All right, so triangle, sell, square is hold on to it. Uh, and then the uh, tab button in the middle, press press that allows you to toggle on between the on-screen menu and the cursor. Navigate to the category in the bottom left and start adding items to your to your lot. Okay. Building basics. Learn the basics of building mod or mode. Will let you build and decorate like a pro. There's a lot here to read and do. Okay. Uh, here you'll find building. Components like rooms, walls, 
Wallpaper, O and stairs, and oh, I just where did I just go? Um, I just disappeared, didn't I? I think this is my house, my my property, my land. Yes, it is. Okay. Um. Okay, so my lot value is eight thousand five hundred. I got my dimensions. I don't have any bedrooms. I don't have any bathrooms. Okay. Lot's name. I could change it. Uh, let's change it to. Uh, let's change it to the playground. It'd be different. Let's see here. Playground for now, so we can find it next time. What's an eyedropper? Okay, eyedropper. We know what that is. Never mind. That drops that stuff. Design tools. Okay. There we go. Building. Object room. Objects by room. You can shop for furniture. Sort by rooms using your objects by room menu and open up. Okay. And contains new items. All right. Ooh, we can select all this stuff and just try to find it. I think we're going to get a little overwhelmed. Um, and the house of inventory. Oh, I just totally just, whoa, this is a little. There we go. Ah, oh, I see now what I'm doing. Woo, crash. I feel like I'm going to fall. Is that like a trolley? It feels like a trolley. Uh, like a train right there of tracks. Okay. Well, we need to stop doing this. There we go. Okay, here we go. There we are. There's my, there I am. Okay, so now what we need to do then is... Get out of that. Okay. I don't want to buy. I just bought something. I don't want to buy it. What just happened? Oh. Okay. How do you cancel that? Can't place outside your boundaries. Um, I just bought. I just bought a counter table for my kitchen. Great. I just stopped time. Okay. All right. All right. What do we got here? Okay. Tip four and four is done. Items might be stored in the house inventory, especially when uh, especially when moving. Okay. Show all. Building a room. There are many tools designed to help you build an incredible room for your Sims quality. Let's take a quick look at some of the tools. Okay. Let's see here. We got uh, surface, plumbing, comfort, skills, activities, decorations, kids, learning, uh, electronics, Appliances storage. Okay. Oh, it's tip one of seven. All right. Let's show all then. But nothing's coming up. Okay. Here we go. Building. Tip two. Select a styled room sort followed by the styled rooms icon to view pre-designed rooms like kitchens or bathrooms. You can also build new rooms from here. Okay, um, uh, let's go with a, uh, is that a hot tub? Looks like a hot tub to me. Oh, it's just a floor pattern. Okay. Floor pattern. Um, w let's just do this then. Uh, we want, uh, let's go wood floors. I believe, yeah. We're gonna do, we're gonna build the living room first, right? Um, what kind of wood do we want? Let's go with this. It's, well, rugged subfloor slats. I like this one. And uh, let's go. Do we want to do this one maybe for the living room? Um, hmm. Yeah, why not? Okay. So now we got to figure out where we're going to put the living room. So we're going to walk in. Let's say the entrance is right here, right? Um, oh, this is going to be a little tricky, isn't it? Oh, what if we do this? What if we back it up? What if we back it up here? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Okay. 
I don't know what that means yet, but I'm learning. Okay, outdoor pools. Oh, that's awesome. Fences, walls, and empty rooms. Oh, that's that 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 right there is what we need to do. Walls and empty rooms. All right, this is what we need. Okay, half walls, walls and trims. I see walls and trims. No. Half walls. Place the entire wall. Tall half wall. Okay. Now, um, let's see here. What do we want to do here? I'm trying to figure this all out because I'm, I'm awesome at this. Oh, you can't place it on the... Okay. Is that my mailbox, though? Oh, that's my mailbox, isn't it? No, 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 no. Okay. So that's my mailbox. Oh, we can do the whole wall like this, can't we? Okay, this is a little bit... No, 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 no. We're getting a little crazy here, aren't we? Okay. I think for some reason we are... Okay. Um, replace half walls by drawing. We want to do this, don't we? This is really exterior trims. Roof. And what's this? What's, what's this? style rooms and this is wall patterns oh, oh, oh. foundation we want a foundation that's what we want first We're trying to figure out how to build a house here aren't we uh we can really size that up okay and then let's go with a nice i don't know this one's kind of cool i like that it's a little design okay place a room or wall to okay place a room or a wall to adjust foundation. Okay. Maybe we can't do foundation. Floor pattern. Walls and empty rooms. Doors. What's this over here? Columns. Stairs. Stair railings. I guess we're just going to go with this. Okay, what do we got here for rooms? The L-shaped room, what's placed the room on room on or deck, use the horizontal arrows to resize it. I want like a I want like a an open size room. So that, that's something a little bit different. Oh, you can keep going down too. Sweet, like a square room, but I want to really open it up. So um <clears throat> basement. Oh, that'd be kind of cool to have a basement. The problem is, is I don't know if we can go underground, can we? That would be really cool. All right, let's see if we can have a basement. Let's see here. Nope. I didn't think so, but I wasn't sure. Let's see here. Okay, we, we did something there. Um, I think we just created our first basement. Um, with no stairs, but we got a basement for $8,000. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. So now that's a cool play playground right there. That is really cool. Look at that boat. That is really cool. It's like a pirate boat. It is a pirate boat. Okay. Back to this. Um, let's go with, whoops. What just happened? Oh, I just sold my basement. I did. I'm still learning how to play this, of course. What if we go this way? Nothing. Okay. So I guess we need to go. That was eight thousand dollars. Okay, maybe my maybe my lot's too big. Maybe I sold. I bought my lot too big. What do you guys think? Maybe I should have went for a smaller lot. <laughs> just a nice little simple house. Um, but I can grow my house, so that's not a bad idea. So what we're going to do then is if that's my mailbox down there, I should have like my house start over here, I think. And what if we just do a like that? Okay. 
and then custom room tool. Um, I gotta see this basement here. I'm gonna kind of worry on this. Oh. Okay. Um. I'm winging it. I'm winging it. I'm totally winging it. Okay. All right. We got our final. We finally got. Okay. Not bad. We got our first floor. Okay. Um, and apparently we have a basement down there that I can't see. And let's see here. Okay. We can filter through. That's kind of cool. Okay. So there's our basement. Okay, but we have no stairs to get up to our basement. Okay. But I like it so far. All right. Let's go with... Um, let's go with stairs. We're going to go with some nice, just random, traditional stairs. Let's go white. I'm feeling kind of white. Oop. Oh, I just sold my floor again. I just sold that. I didn't want to sell that. Um, nope, I just sold my basement too. All right, I am pressing the wrong button apparently. Okay, so if I do that. And then. I press my L2 button. It sells it. That is interesting. Okay, well, at least I know now. That's good. And is that a bird? I think it's a bird. He's just chilling, isn't he? I don't know what's going on with the bird. He's looking kind of creepy. All right, well, there's my character, at least. So if I come over here, I like the grid line. I'm going to grab that. And... Oh, 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 oh. Can I zoom in? Okay. If I grab this, <clears throat> I just sell it back. Okay, cool. Well, we got my property. I put some stuff down. I'm going to see if I can get some less, more stuff going. Uh, this is Leo the Leopard, and uh, this is our Sims 4. We're going to give it a shot. We're going to see if we can build a nice little small house and expand and get a job and stuff. So until next time, everyone, don't forget that like and that subscribe button. Bye!